me the option of the side court, but you ain't got no do say. So then we took the Hennessy. Ebony. <laughs> you not getting a commercial like that. <laughs> but he made his demise at the store. Yes, the store is closed, so we cannot go to the store. Oh God. Y'all, this is where we at. Like, ride with me if you ride with me, you can slide with me if you feel like 550 on the five sticky, you can get high with me, that's a deal. What's up, who things? I'm Nicole, also known as Coley Cole. If you are new and you stumbled across the channel, over here we do a little bit of hair, a little bit of makeup. We do quite a few hauls, but most of all, we do a whole lot of living. It's a lifestyle channel, so if that's your vibe, click the button. You see that little button? It's a little button in the corner. Maybe this corner, that corner. I don't know, but it's a button. Click it. It says subscribe. Thank you. Notification bell on so that you know when I post new videos. Boo things. Um, my back itching. I ain't got nobody to scratch it. Anyway, it is Friday. Remy Friday. Don't know how this first Remy Friday in LA is going to go, but it is. It's 514. Ebony found a super Walmart because she was determined. Granted, once again, without a kitchen, kitchenette, there's only so much we can do. But we went, we grabbed some stuff. I feel like the only thing extra that I got, I got more, I got more oatmeal. I've never tried this one. Because I always eat this one. But I got those chips. Um, what else did I get? Oh. Comment down below. The only flavor of these toasted Ritz I've ever had in my entire life. Um, or the sour cream and onion flavor toasted ones. And what I wanted to show y'all that I found at Super Walmart. Y'all want to see my refrigerator? Y'all want to see my little mini fridge? Bam. Honey, we didn't shove. I got these. Now, I know Ebony got one. Hers was a different brand. Hers, you have to actually add the egg yourself. This one comes with a egg in that little container right there so that was the difference we i've had this before it's just been a minute so i wanted to show y'all that and oh my little girl why did nobody tell me i could get a simply orange in this little handheld container but in a pack of four so I got a pack of those. Oh, and I got this too. Once again, an ebony recommendation. However, I told her I feel like when I eat it, I'm gonna need some hot sauce, some salsa, some ketchup, some something, Jesus. But we're gonna try it. We're gonna see what it's talking about. And that's the only thing extra that I added. Because we already had the juices. I got those. I got some hummus. I got some more cheese sticks. Because if I can't chew nothing else, I can always eat a cheese stick and not die. But that's about it. So we're gonna I'm gonna Google some restaurants. And I'm gonna come back and talk to y'all in a minute because we need to find somewhere to go eat. I just want to talk about the fact that it just took us 20 minutes to find a parking spot because all downtown LA there's very minimal street parking and then the garages and the parking lots all want cash in 2022 don't nobody carry cash however my friend found some hidden in her wallet she likes to keep her change. She likes somebody grandma. She likes to keep what? Yo, all your five fives? Dollars. All of her five dollars. But what do you do? Do you deposit them? At the end of the year? At the I mean, end of the year. She basically calculated up and see how much money she got in fives. But then that means you one of them people that still toting cash for you to get change Random. in fives. Sometimes. Don't judge me. Judge your mama. <laughs> anyway. We found a parking spot, and we're about to go see what this food be about. And at this rate, I gotta pee. Like, ride with me if you ride with me, you can slide with me if you feel like. 550 on the five stick, you can get high with me, that's a deal, right? Ride with me if you ride with me, you can slide with me if you feel like. 550 on the five stick, you can get high with me, that's a deal, right? That's a deal, right? That's a bet, right? This is what happens when you tell your friend to be sexy. That's a no. <laughs> no, she said, can you be sexy? Can and I was like, be yeah, sexy? Be. I was like, it was it. Follow me on TikTok. 
TikTok if you want to see what it actually looks like. Because it was off the top. Ebony. <laughs> you not get a commercial like that. <laughs> Bottom feeding out of line, turn your heart rate to a dotted line. Yeah, my zodiac probably dollar sign. Got the energy to win in my I'm feeling great. Got a date with destiny, focusing on my fate. I don't give a fuck what you rapping, you been a fake. You trying to get me monetized? We back in the car. I don't know if y'all can see me because I'm dark. You want to give a review? On Kai, is it Kai? I don't know. Kay, you know where we was at. Um. <clears throat> Uh, six out of ten. The servers were nice and mm -hmm. pleasant. Mm -hmm. They did not know the menu. Um, the food was okay. Mm -hmm. Nothing to write home about. Um, <laughs> that's it. That's all I got, guys. <sighs> I mean, I guess five or a six so i had the rasta pasta my salmon was good pasta tastes like nothing pasta only had spice pasta needed chef earl in the kitchen with the seasonings and the white wine because all they did was slung some um jalapeno peppers and some cracked red pepper in it her mashed potatoes were cold her mashed potatoes came out before her meal which what was your meal the short ribs short ribs her mashed potatoes came out before the short ribs which made no sense her mashed potatoes came out with, with her, side her side salad y'all gave me a sidecar menu says do say do say or hennessy were their only ones do say or hennessy for the cognacs they did not have but you give me the option of the sidecar but you ain't got no do say so then we took the hennessy then Cocktails are supposed to be served in a cocktail glass, in a cocktail or, glass or something of the sort. Y'all gave it to me in a plastic, in a clear plastic cup. You also gave me my water in a cup. And granted, we were outside. Inside, there were glasses on the table, which are the glasses that they used for water. So, I'm pretty sure if we sat inside, you would have gave us glass. I don't know. You know, I've never owned a restaurant. I don't know. But, like Ebony said, if you're trying to give me a drink. And you want me to think that my drink is full. Don't bring it to me in a 10-ounce cup. And give me 5 ounces of alcohol. I don't even think it was 5. That's my review. On Kai's table, put it on your list. You come, you eat, you drink, you smoke. Hookah, I could taste the flavor, but those of you who smoke hookah, like you pick up what I'm putting down. It was a situation with the coals, and then you don't give me tongs, so I can't move them, so I couldn't get like the full effect of my hookah. But that's not a here nor there. And the hookah is $60. We was we barely made happy hour, so we got it for thirty. But regularly, one hookah is sixty dollars, and a refill is thirty. We are not in Kansas anymore. We'll be back. <laughs> Then you would really do something and then I'd really be upset. Anyway, 
Happy Sunday. It's not Sunday. Because I go to work on Sunday. It's Saturday. Happy Saturday. First Remy Friday in LA. I'm not going to say it was a bust, but Remy Fridays never hit right when we're not at home. So it's Saturday. It's noon. We wanted to shoot for a massage today. But the place that we wanted to go to doesn't have appointments until nighttime. And nine times out of ten, by the end, we're going to be over it. I mean, you know, like if I was going with a man, I'd probably be into it. But I'm going with Ebony. If we was going to go, then we, it would have made more sense to go during the day so we could go and do other stuff. Um, but we're going to try. I think we're going to shoot for... I don't even know if it's going to be considered brunch by the time we get dressed and we get there. But we're going to try this place called uh, The District by GS. Comment down below if you know anything about it. They uh, Somebody needs to work on their Instagram. But the TikTok looks lit. Let's just, you know, pray to sweet baby Jesus that the food is good. In there somewhere for us to sit if and when we show up I don't know I'm gonna insert the clip because I recorded it off of my phone last night on the way home the rental car we kept hearing this noise and we couldn't figure out what it was so we had to turn mo three down so we could listen and it was like what does she call it because you Evan is like half man. She knows stuff that most women do not know. I don't know. She just built like that. Her daddy, her daddy didn't have a son, so he treated Ebony like a son and taught her all type of random shit. So whatever this part is that's under the car, like I showed it to y'all in the clip. All right, y'all, this is where we at. Our rental is coming apart, and my friend is out here being a whole. Like, it's missing a whole piece underneath here. Uh-huh. Like, there's a whole piece missing. I don't understand. It's the, um... Fox better take this shit back and not be trying to say we broke it. It's the guard. Y'all better get y'all the evidence. That's all I can say. My good friend Ebony said we can do one or two things. We can take it back. And then they're probably going to say we done it when we did it. Because we know neither one of us have. Like we ain't ran over no curb. We ain't ran over animal or a person. Um, or we could get some good scissors and just cut it. I just ironed that shirt. Because in my head, you probably can't hear me because the air... It's one of two things. It's either it's on and it's cold and it's loud or it's off and it's hot and it feels like New Orleans doing Essence Festival. Comment down below if you know what I mean. I ironed this shirt because I had an idea in my head. And it's halfway ironed because I ain't got no starch. But people in California don't care about ironing. I'm the only one that care about ironing. So, but anyway, I had an idea in my head. And now I don't know if I want to follow through with my idea and I only got a handful of outfits. This is that one time, yes, Shaw, you were, why are you doing this to me? Why has thou forsaken me? Just focus, Lord, just focus. I cannot. This shirt is really killing me. Can y'all see that? At home, I would never. But guess what? We not at home. When in Rome. Because y'all y'all know my best friend, Shaw. Shaw is from the Bay. Shaw didn't own an iron. Yes, I'm putting your business out there. She didn't own an iron until she came to Houston. As a matter of fact, I don't even think she got the damn iron anymore because she was just talking about she ordered a steamer because she hate using the iron. Anyway, ain't nobody going to be worried about this shirt but me and Ebony. So, I wanted like a little cute casual vibe 
but right now I wish I had some biker shorts like biker shorts a little crop shirt and then I could put my button up on over it but I ain't got that so what the hell can I put on I hate adulting I ain't looking for outfits y'all already know this this is not new let me get my life together before Ebony be texting me talking about ready. Okay. I don't know how I feel about it, but it's on and we're going to roll with it. My wrinkled shirt, this Fashion Nova onesie. Um, and then I was debating if I wanted to do a sneaker or a sandal. And I'm going to go with the sandal. I don't even know how to get y'all to see the whole thing but anyway we're leaving because guess what ebony's ready <laughs> District, the district by GS. I don't know what GS is or who GS is. <laughs> it's giving me real Houston vibes. You know, lights, cameras, action, video, music. They had a DJ. It looks like they have a live band at some point, but the live band was not there today. A DJ was giving me old school vibes, you know, like mom and dad vibes, auntie, 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 uncle vibes. <laughs> Acceptable. Um, the food was actually good. It was more of like a southern food southern cuisine mm -hmm. i had the um it was good shrimp um no i had the catfish and grits she don't even know what she had talking about it shrimp. was good real good i had the salmon i think they call it double something double, double surf, surf because i had salmon and um grilled shrimp with asparagus and mashed potatoes and it was all good like it was all seasoned and we had the uh <laughs> two two not one but two of the premium dizzle i don't know what dizzle or who dizzle is <laughs> but we had two of those <laughs> now the dizzle comes with it is tequila cognac and, of your choice well the menu has tequila and hennessy but y'all already know we substituted the hennessy for remy and it was a couple dollars more because i feel like on the menu that drink was 18 dollars. it was 18 on the menu we pay 18 mm -hmm. okay never mind anyway we spent 72 dollars on drinks but the drink is tequila cognac mango margarita mix and grand Marnier. 
which is very good together. It was delicious. Can't it wait was... for Cole to re replicate it, duplicate it, reciprocate it. Anyway. <laughs> What's um, going on behind us, guys? Well, um, I feel like niece has brought auntie or mama out. And they going to the district. district. Auntie or mama is really excited about it. And told her to pull his coat. Because she went in her parking spot. Huh. And now she walking off. And daughter or niece ain't even out the car yet. Anyway. What what's, what what are you taking me to do? We are now en route to um, Nipsey's memorial. Where he was unfortunately met his uh, demise. Are we going to his store? No, his store is closed. But... He made his demise at the store. Yes, his store is closed, so we cannot go to the store. But we're going to go to the intersection and see if we can get you guys some footage of the memorial. And then my Uber driver will be taking me to the Nipsey Hustle Memorial, which is a little bit further north. And then my Uber driver will be taking me somewhere I can um, partake in a little bit of extra cocktails and a little bit of tobacco in my lungs. I'm sorry, I didn't know that she had an Uber driver. <laughs> Secondly, she got all this and she likes to say, it's content, it's content. First off, I'm the one wielding the camera every day of where, and she loves to say, it's content, get the camera. You get the motherfucking camera. Oh, God. And I gotta go to work tomorrow. <laughs> exactly. Oh. I told her, to, y'all tell her to put herself on the schedule with me tomorrow. Guarantee 48. Not tomorrow. 48 plus 12. Extra. Huh? We all need a little extra mm -hmm. in our lives. No one needs extra stress. <laughs> I can't argue with that. I can't argue with that. Straight off the lot, 300 cash, and the car came with a blood in it. The mama a thot, and she got ass, and she gon' fuck up a bag. Pull up to the spot, living too fast, dropping the dope in the stash. In Italy, got too far, hoes they DM me. Drop the top, when it's cold, but you feel the heat. Be real with me, keep it 100, just be real with me. Eat it up like it's a feast. Eat it up. They said it don't go flee. Yeah. Percocet, feel all over. I saw my nigga, chill with me. I can make a difference in the back. Don't say nothing, the niggas are kill for me. Back as I count in my sleep, I'll sleep. My neck is spinning the bed for me. Bitch, I'm a dog in my tree. Hop out the frog and leap. I put them bricks in the fender. My bitch, you walk around like she's Christian. I used to break in the handle. It's like I'm running like the game of Tampa. It's simple, I play with a mantle. Mama said she saw me on Jimmy Kimmel. Canada, cause I'm a minor symbol. Walking with the rest, I'm looking crippled. Fuck on that bitch, then I tip him. A nigga for me to take pictures. Not from my leg, but I clip him. truck the neighborhood ice cream truck so i said we had two and as an adult i don't know why we had two separate ones so one i always had they have shit else that i remember but a bomb pop and them nasty ass orange flintstone push-ups and then there was another one that strictly had ice cream whether it was an ice cream cone or ice sandwich. cream cup yep ice cream sandwich but ice cream but i was all the way in arkansas in Ebony was in Shreveport, Louisiana. How the hell did the uh, ghetto neighborhood ice cream people have the same shit? Same stuff. And, and <laughs> wait, tell them what you said. It tastes like <laughs> the push up. Turn it to a shoe. Even as a child, I realized that the push up, when you take the paper off the top of it, the push up was in a toilet paper holder. And then it was a plastic thing, you just, a plastic plunger, you just keep pushing <laughs> up until you got out of the sherbet. And the, the, the uh, push up tastes what like. What I knew that it was sherbet? The push up. It was not sherbet. It was terrible. It was a child. It was, because I was like, this don't taste like ice cream. <laughs> but I'm going to keep eating it. And I was like, why does it taste different? Then I realized it was the same ice cream that they use at the church when they put it in the punch. And I read it and I it said sherbet. Anyway. I cannot. 
can't. The push-up tastes like cardboard. <laughs> the cardboard paper towel holder that it was in, that's what the push-up tastes like. But as a child, I was like, this is nasty. But I just got off the ice cream truck, and my mama going to get mad if I don't eat it. So I'm going to eat it. <laughs> and when he come back the next week or the next two days, I'm going to get it again, and I'm going <laughs> to still eat it. Hopefully, he have a bomb pop. I can get the bomb pop because that's what I really like, but he, they didn't have it all the time. Because the kids always got it. That was the first thing they wanted out the freaking truck. <laughs> anyway, comment down below and let us know if you had an ice cream ice cream truck. And if you did, what was you getting off the ice cream truck? Because now we curious because we just figured out both trucks had the same shit and we was in two different states. So is that what all the ice cream trucks had? Yes, that's all and right, I'm curious to know right now in 2022, I ain't never seen so many ice cream trucks in my life than I have in the five days that I've been in Los Angeles. So what I really want to know is what is on the ice cream. We need to go to one, bitch. We need to get some cash and go to, we need to stop at one. And what? An ice cream truck. Why you don't? So your we phone ain't say shit. We ain't passed. Oh, you turned it down. We ain't passed it. Yet. Okay. Goodbye. Comment down below. Money, you know what?